What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma, wherever you may be, however you may be watching. Thanks for making this video a part of your day. Now I know today there was a huge um, influx of WWE 2K18 videos um, from guys like Macho and Chris Danker and Pulse and Tubby Emu and Tony Pizza Guy and all these guys. Um, so I appreciate you coming by, checking out some Lucha Libre AAA. Um, I've also got some WWE 2K18 videos coming um, that and go into Universe Mode and the Road to Glory Mode and something else a little special. Um, but we're not here to talk about that right now. We are in the Rudos campaign. Um, about 70% through, we're about three quarters of the way through it. Um, and we are going to be Abysmo Negro versus the Zombie Clown. The show must go on. I want look at this dude. That is serious. That is a serious looking dude right there. But no one dares to enter Los Payasos' home can leave without a king-sized slice of action from one of its proud owners. When Abismo Negro approaches the House of Horrors looking for information, Zombie Clown looks forward to giving Abismo more than words. No count out, no DQ, which is good. We can get some chairs and some light tubes in there uh, considering we're, we're bad guys. I mean, we are the Rudos. So let's get into our no DQ matchup here with Zombie Clown. Zombie Clown. The oh, we are Zombie officer. Clown. Abismo I assumed Negro. we were going to be Abismo Zombie Negro. I was mistaken. So we get we got the clown. We've got some clown action going. Not a whole lot of moves there from the head that you can do. Okay, and. Oh, I thought he was going out. He was going to go out out the ring there if we got him. I guarantee you he's going to be limp. Get, get off me. He's gonna have to Big kick. Tommy Clown now. He's got Negro up. Oh, no. He kicks away. And Negro with the butterfly. Ooh. Drops him down hard to the mat. Zombie Clown pushes him away. Again. Oh, man. These guys are just going at it. Nobody wants to be on the losing end, and it looks like it's Negro going to be on the... Oh, look at that sky high. Jeez Louise. Get in the corner. Oh, nice reversal. And a <laughs> Up top goes Zombie Clown. Good grief. Oh, big drop kick. And now again with the butterfly double underhooks. No. Zombie Clown is not going out like that. Nice move there. Zombie picks him up. And he gets pushed away. Same. Same. Uh-oh. Double underhooks again. Abysmo Negro with just the same move over and over. Zombie, cl zombie Clown, excuse me, not going to let that happen. Come on now. Oh. oh, holy cow. That was pretty intense. Zombie Clown's got him up. Oh, the scorpion death drop from Zombie Clown. And that looks like it's going to be it for Abysmo Negro. And we have unlocked him if we care to use him. <laughs> well, that wasn't creepy at all. Jeez. All right, so this one's called the Heel Couple. El Cybernetico versus, or excuse me, El Cybernetico and El Apache versus Chessman and Conan. Now I'm assuming we'll be Chessman and Conan. Um, El Apache... We mentioned in previous videos in the Technicos, he passed away a couple of weeks ago. Um, he was a pretty big part of Lucha Libre AAA. And um, a lot of people on Twitter pouring out their love for this man. So let's uh, keep it going here. The young Rudo is now ready to join Conan on the tour as he enters the spectacle. A match between the teams of Conan and Chessman versus Cybernetico and Al Apache is ready to get underway. DQ on, 20 second out. Let's do it. We're going to burn through these. Connor never thought that I would get this close to him. Now that I am, I will let him get away so easily. I need to plot my next move, but first I must study him. 
so that I may exploit his weaknesses when we finally meet in battle. So apparently, if you're a Rudo, you don't care who you fight. So Puma, uh, Voorhees, is um, is ready to just get get it done with Conan. Man, Chessman over there taking care of business. Look at this. Look at this submission. Jeez. Big slap by Chessman. Oh no, he blocks the kick. And into a small package. No. This is craziness going on right now. This is just nonsense. We have got to... Jeez. Dang it. Why do you keep going for the small package, bruh? And if Conan doesn't stop hitting the ref, we're going to be screwed. All right, bruh. No, we're just going to take down Apache here. Can't do any of this move. Look at Conan with the Tequila Sunrise. Okay. Uh-oh. Let's get up. No, we're going to block. Dude, what is going on here? That's the only. That's a bad thing. I mean, we get all tied up. We don't know who's facing who and what's going on here. Good kick. Uh oh. Dang, he was just out of reach in DDT to Chessman. And he's gonna try to break up that submission. And he... What a German suplex from Chessman. And look at this. Way up. Oh, nice power bomb into a pin. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, apparently we're going over here now. Get off me. Oh my goodness. Out goes Chessman. Back in we are here now. Get off me. And a nice snapmare from Chessman. Dang it, I pushed the wrong button and get German for my troubles. I mean, it looks like Conan's going to have to do a move here. There we go. Tequila Sunrise to the Apache. Uh-oh. No. There we go. Spinning back body drop. We're going to run out of the way here. And, oh, nice. We're going to hook up the arm. Oh, we're gonna let go so we don't get we don't get it. Dang, dang. Oh Bulldog to his own partner. Hey man, that's that's what I like to see. Come on, got him. Flipping German suplex. Very nice. Chessman now with the cybernetico. No, he pushes him off at a drop kick. Chessman with Cybernetical back up. No. And look at... Oh, nice Manhattan drop there. Uh-oh. Back body drop by Apache. This, uh, this is getting wild here. Nice reversal. Ooh. Dang it. Get off me. Chessman up with the suplex. Very nice. And Chessman now going up top. Big headbutt. Good move there from Chessman. Dude, I didn't even get a chance to reverse. And Apache takes it to us. Get up. Cybernetico. Up on the shoulders into the lung blower. Very nice move. That is, that is good to see. Oh. No All right. Okay. Yep. I'll take that. And he counts one. Uh oh. Jeez. Ooh. We've unlocked Cybernetico. What a crazy mess that was. We almost let a Apache get the, get yes, the man, pin break up. Smelling the air of sweet success. We have a so winner. Here we go. The Italian interference. It's gonna be Voorhees versus Marco Corleone versus Conan. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's uh. Let's back out real quick, see where we are percentage-wise on finishing up this uh, 
this Rudo's story mode here. 77, okay. We, we might still have some life left in us here. The new Rudo thinks he'll find Conan alone in the gym at night, but gets more than he bargained for when the Technico shows up looking for answers. Will this end in combat between these three powerful luchadors? I bet it does. Here we go! The moment of truth is here! Heroes del Ring Lucha Libre! Everybody's ready! So let's lucha! What a great demonstration. Oh man, you're not getting me. Yikes. And a big kick. And you know what? We're going straight after Conan here. And we're going to just put the boots to Conan. Oh, maybe, maybe we don't get our freaking faces destroyed. Ha! Ah. And got in a Manhattan drop there. Very nice. He's got it from behind. No. Nope. Like oh, that was a good move. A little dragon su suplex that looked like. Look at what he's nope. Doing, Whoa, that's and, jeez, you want to tell me how that's possible? Jeez so Louise, this is a crazy mess. And this dude with those kicks, jeez. Come on now. Conan with the with the small package. <laughs> nice dropping Marco. Bruh. Get off. Ooh. Oh man, what a clothesline. Dang it. Conan again with that small package. These guys be loving them some, some roll-ups. And we're going to drop you on your head. And drop you to the mat, because I don't know what you're doing. Oh, jeez. Get off me. Nope, that did not take place. Break up the pin. Ooh. To be oh man. Last grace, elegance. That is okay. Nope. Uh oh. Look at that. Nice back bot. Now, uh, backbreaker, I should say. Uh uh. Nope. You can do that shit to Conan all you want. Picks him up. Double underhook. Power bomb. No. And a Manhattan drop there. Get off me. Big jawbreaker there. Very nice. Uh oh, okay. I mean, if you guys are going to battle it out, I'll let that shit happen. Oh! Dang it. I missed it. Dude! Conan is not fooling around here, folks. And a backbreaker to Conan. He's got to be in pain. What? This is such a cluster. Get off me. Get off me. No. Uh-oh, Conan can't do the move. Jawbreaker there. Get off. Did I get it? Boom! Big clothesline. Bruh. I'm taking somebody, and it just happens to be Conan. Straight to hell. Nope. Oh, okay. Nope. Golly, dude. You're messing everything up. Ha! Huh, I don't think so, bruh. Nice reversal there from Conan into a backbreaker. Oh my goodness. Big kick to the face by Voorhees. No. Look at this. Pump handle, power slam. And another backbreaker to Conan. He has just got to be completely broken here. And we're going to go for the pin on Conan. And can we get it? Yes. This young punk has a long way to go, but as of tonight, 
He scored an and look at this, a betrayed legionnaire. It's Voorhees versus Conan. After the last minute conflict with Marco Corleone, the Rudo is finally ready to confront Conan once and for all. No count outside, no disqualification. Is it going to be for the Mega Championship? Let's find out. Finally, Conan, just you and me in the same ring. I've waited so long for this moment, so you can eat all your humiliations and bad teachings. It's payback time, and the belt will have a new owner. This guy has left a long line of broken... Nice, let's go. And you can start off by eating one of those. Oh, okay, he can block kicks too, apparently. Dang it, a little slow on that, and Conan with that little small package, man, that ain't gonna work, bro. Ooh. Kicks and a big boot. That was a slow pickup of the, the legs there. Nice spinning move there by Voorhees, and wow. Conan got out of that pretty quick. And we're going to... Bow! Outside we go, because we are going for the, the chair. Come on at me, bro. Come at me. Oh! He took that one big time. And we just broke the chair over his head. Not today, Conan. And a oof, eat that clothesline, bro. Won't you come at me with the light tubes? Got him. Oof, right across the face. Oh, that was nice. All right, I see you. Uh-oh, going up top. And a big clothesline sends us down. Voorhees now back to his feet. Get off. Uh-oh. Nice move there by Voorhees to dodge. Clothesline to Conan. And here we go. Headbutt. Very nice. Pick him up. Conan with the reversal and another big slam down. So that means Voorhees going up top and a kick. But we're not done yet. Boom. That is, my friend, what we call a spear. Straight to hell goes Conan. Very nice. Now, I kind of want to see something. I want to see something. So when we grab those light tubes and we press the grapple star, button, he slammed uh, that those tubes into Conan's face. <laughs> Come on now. Come in the ring because I want to... Okay, so we have a grapple move. Oh, shoot. Oh, dude, he poked me in the eye. Oh, and a DDT. Okay, stand it on me. I don't appreciate that. Get down. Come on. All right. Now I need you to stand up. Got him. Oh, good lord. That was crazy. Up he goes. And I needed a face. And we get there first with the neck breaker. And what else can we do from the top rope? Nice. And it's about that time. Oh! Oh, man, that was quick. And right... Oh, Conan walks right into a straight to hell. And that's going to be it, I'm guessing, for the terrible teacher that is Conan. What a night. My former leader lying in defeat by my hands in the same gym where he has mistreated me so many times. But my satisfaction is short-lived when he confesses that he doesn't have my belt. It seems that there's another, one who calls himself Senor Mega Championship, who stands in the way of my destiny. Broken, Conan says, See, it looks like I'm not the rudest of the rudos. Of course you are not. I am the true chosen one. Oi, I am the true chosen one. So now, now that Conan has been defeated... And he doesn't have the belt like we assumed he did. Fighting for the leadership. 
Voorhees versus Electroshock, Zoro, and Kenzo. Upon arriving at the most sacred in all of AAA Lucha Libre, the Rudo is surprised to see other Rudos battling each other for the right to meet the legendary luchador Conan talked about in battle. He enters the fray with the confidence that he will emerge victorious. No DQ, but there is a 20 second count out. So let's do it. Here we go. Man, and we start off against Electroshock. And he's gonna stop us, but no, we're gonna get them kicks in. And we are uh, back and forth here, but not before we get that Alabama slam. Very nice. And here we go. We're just gonna start wailing on Electroshock, but he's able to push us off. And we are just gonna grab anybody that we're able to. And it's gonna be Zoro. Get up. Here we go. Oh, pin, I mean, geez. reversal from Zoro again. Nope. Jeez. I can't stop anything here. Zoro about to, well, I was gonna say about to catch this backbreaker, but that ain't happening. Dang. Come on, Zoro. Look at that. See, that would be a very cool move if it was a DDT. And I think that would be freaking awesome. Nice snapmare. And we're going to choke the man out here. We don't get an option to reverse, but look at this submission. Criminy. So, no DQ. Let's just get in the ring here and grab somebody. And it's going to be Kenzo. And he takes those light tubes straight to the face. And, and look, got him up. Manhattan drop. Very nice. Get off. Dude. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll pick on Electroshock. I don't care. Oh, man. You're going to do all that? Shoot. DDT from Electroshock, and Kenzo gets the kick, and now Electroshock goes up with the elbow, and we catch him with the neck breaker. And we'll do a little taunting. No, come on now, I know I pushed the dang button. Stomp across the chest from Electroshock. And pushed off by Zoro, who seems to be bleeding. And a backbreaker there to Zoro. Let's go up top. And we catch Zoro. Oh, and everybody chimes in on that one. Just give me somebody to grab. I don't care. And then Zoro, you are the unlucky one. Because you get planted there. Boom, nice jawbreaker. Oh, Jeez, he popped up quick. Neck breaker to Zoro. And no, he kicks us in the face. Too early. And Zoro, what's he got for us? A fall away slam. Man, this is a crazy mess. I don't know how we're going to get anything done like a pin. That's just, is that out, out of the question here? To get a pin? And a jawbreaker right there. Get kicked. Come on, man. Stop him. There we go. Get kicked and no. He just like hurricane punches us to the chest. I don't even know what a hurricane punch is. But it seems like it would that's what that was. Go! Oh, we take out everybody! And Kenzo, my friend, you get to be the first to go straight to hell. Uh-oh. That would be it. But these guys aren't stopping it. And he waited for the two count. And a backbreaker to Kenzo. I didn't mean to pick up Zoro here. Okay, what's happening? And a knee, and no, we miss with the knee. 
We don't miss Zora with that back body drop. Oh, he's got us with the neck breaker. Cheese and rice. I'm going to assume this is elimination. Because if it were not elimination... Come on. German. Get off. Oh my gosh. We were getting it from all angles on that one. Not in time. And a back body drop. If this weren't elimination, I mean, why would there be a count out? That's, that's what I'm thinking. Sending Zoro across the ring. Oh! He eats a spear. And big clothesline there. Everyone stand up. Ah, we only get one. That's okay. I'll take the one. Dude. All right. You get the neck breaker. And Zoro, you're about to get put straight to hell. There we go. We go for the pin. Dang it, I thought Kenzo was like in the middle of doing something. Get off me. Jeez. Not today. Not from you either. You get up and get the neck breaker. Oh my goodness, we go out of the ring. We go flying out of the ring, but you know what? We're going to try to grab somebody here. Kenzo, stand up. Because if I'm going to. We might have to eliminate one of these dudes. Okay, that ain't. None of this is working. So I better get back in. Come on now. You're not going to get me. Oh. Dang, we get kicked in the back of the head by Electroshock. And nope. Oh, shoot. I can't stop it. And it's not elimination. It's not elimination. All right, that was a long one, so we'll catch back up with this one in progress. He's losing too much time. He could be counted out. He almost hurt himself trying to do that move. Incredible. Can you believe the speed of Zoro Super? <laughs> he looks like he's about to pin him. And that's a two. This can't be happened. Okay. That happened very quickly. My plan was to come in and... You know, and just like that, folks, it's over. That is it. I tried to get Kenzo counted out. Um, I didn't think this was an elimination, and I was right. So we've unlocked the Pyramids 2 uh, uh, map. So that's cool. We can get some more unlocks. And we, let's see who's going to be the big, bad luchador we have to face for that mega championship. Oh, boy. The Wagner Maniacs. Now this is, uh, we had to do this in the last one and it was not easy. A two-on-one is never easy. But we're going to take on Silver King and Dr. Wagner. And somebody's going to have to get counted out. That's just how that's going to be. And another unexpected setback. The mighty Dr. Wagner, a luchador feared by both Rudos and Technicos alike, has been watching the action waiting for the others to pick each other off one by one. Finally. Dr. Wagner and his fierce partner, Silver King, enter the ring. No count out, no disqualification. All right, come on now. Get off me. Pushing these guys off. That's what I need right there. Shoot. The problem is that the game like doesn't want you to, to have any kind of victory over a two-on-one kind of thing. Because, I mean, these guys, I mean, I can be doing stuff to them the, the whole time, and it doesn't matter. Get off. There we go. There we go. Pick him up. Alabama Slamma. Oh, come on. Okay, you dummies. 
Oh, get away. Get off. Uh, reversals are going to be my saving grace here. There we go. I should have been able to try to do something there, but these guys... Dang. That's all right. At least it wasn't a move. Get off me. Get away. That's what I need right there. That's my opening. Dang. And it's wasted with a blocked kick. We get sat on. Jeez. Come on now. You get off. There we go. Get down. Get off me. And catch this jawbreaker. Shoot. Dude, I don't know what we got to do here. And we catch a drop kick. Get off me. Get away. No. Not too late on that one. And we get hit with that John Cena slam. There we go. Run off. Nice. Be going for the top, hey? Nope. Dang it, man! I'm early on that on that one. And Conan says they're out of food at the snack bar. There we go. Get down. There we go. You can take a, a seat and shoot. That friggin' kick, man. Alright, you're not gonna get me. What, okay. Reversal after reversal here. Get off. Shoot! Thank goodness. There we go. Dang it. I'm still there we go. Get off me. Get kicked. And now we're gonna send this dude up top. Reverse Frankensteiner. And he just gets right up from a reverse Frankensteiner. Catches Silver King. There we go. Here we go. Dead gummit. Uh, we're so close too. To sending somebody straight to hell run. I wonder if he's planning to fly. Dead. Okay, we have our finisher, but it's not going to matter if we can't get out of this. Which submissions are fairly simple, I think. There we go. Pump handle. There we go. Nope. And he's going to run off. Oh, man, you bunch of... There we go. That's how I. That's what I think about that. Get up, and we're gonna send this fool straight to hell, just like that. Get off me and get kicked. Can we pin him out here? That would have been it. Jeez, these kicks keep getting blocked. They're screwing me. Get off. I've never seen anybody break out of that hole before. Golly, man. I I don't know what to do here. That that could be a start. Oh man. I got to stop doing that kick. And just as I say I got to stop doing that kick, the first thing I try to do when I get up is kick. Come on. Damn it. We're at the point now that if they just went to pin, I'm thinking that would be it. Even though no finishers have been hit or anything like that. All right. I'm just going to go for the pin. You piece of garbage. Oh, man. 
I freaking had him, and you had to dork with the ref. You gotta admit, that's a great counter. <laughs> that kick. Get off. No. There we go. There we go. Damn, that kick. I don't know why I keep trying to do it. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, my gosh. We can't take too many more of those. There we go. Thank goodness. Get down. You can get down. Jeez, man. That's supposed to be like my go-to. That's supposed to be like my get-out-of-jail-free card, and it is not. Out. And back around. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm just swinging this at the first person that gets close to me. Go for the pin. Come on. No, just a two count. So Silver King is a little more damaged, so it looks like that's who I need to go after. And he's down. And he's down. Duh. Oh, man. I don't know why I keep trying that kick. That kick is going to be the bane of my existence here. Get off me. Shoot. There we go. And huge Alabama slam. Nope. There we go. Dang. Wagner got up quick. And a big old Alabama slam there. And a pump handle power slam there. And a big kick and just go for the pin. Thank goodness. Oh my gosh. What a pain in the ball sack. We did it though. No dynasty is left standing. El Regreso del Espectro. The most Rudo is what that says. Let's see. El Rudo has subdued some of the finest luchadors in all of the AAA. Along the way, he has gained strength, experience, and most importantly, the respect of the AAA fans. But he will need more than this if he is to be the successful in the final episode of this uncanny journey. Here at the most holy temple in all of Lucha Libre AAA, the legendary luchador waits for me. I say, this hasn't been an easy journey. I have brought what is left of Conan to prove my worthiness to face you in battle. There are many stories about your legend. I've come here to see for myself what is fact and what is fiction. El Espectro Jr. All right, so we're going to end this one the same way we ended the last one, and that is against El Spectro Jr. Now, if you were, uh, didn't catch that one, this was a serious matchup. I mean, the man's got no shoes on. He's got, like, the scariest mask in the game, and it took us uh, quite a bit to get the victory over him the last time. But, man... Can we catch him on the run? Yeah, we do. But we're going to get back in the ring. And every time I would get uh, get my finisher riled up and ready, he would run off just like that. But you know what? You can't run when you're unconscious. And we're going to just take care of business quick with him because you never know um, when he's just going to pop up and just beat the crap out of you. So. Oh, no. Man, that was a big one. Okay, nice reversal. And a... Bruh, bruh. And another big Alabama slam. And we're going to come right off the gate here with the clothesline. I can't move. Look at what he's Up top, doing, Jack. follow that with a nice diving headbutt. Oh, 
If you watched, uh, caught the last one, you'll know that damn knee was just a killer for me. Up top, I wish we could do wake up taunts and stuff. Come on, get off me. No. Down he goes. And man, it took us a few times to beat him last time, but I don't think it's going to be that way this time. Although it did take four Puma Cutters for us to beat him last time. So that's two straight to hells. Oh, that is close. That is close. Come on now. Big knee to the face. Oh, man, he catches us with the running DDT. The good thing is, though, I was just about to say I've got those reversals on, on point. <laughs> maybe not, but maybe so. Here we go. And man, a big moonsault off the top rope. Uh-oh. Russian leg sweep from a Spectro, and he's going to do a little taunt. Oh, man, another running DDT. The goal here is to not let him get his finisher. I mean, that is part of, that is like one goal. Big spear. Very nice. And snapmare. Uh-oh. Bruh, get that kick out of here. No, I don't want to win that way. Cut loose. Jeez. I want to get I want to get that straight to hell on this boy. Jeez. Huge pile driver. No. <laughs> that sucks for you. Manhattan drop. Get up. Okay. Shit. And you can't reverse those coming off the ropes apparently. You can reverse that. We'll go up top again. Che right in the chest. Jawbreaker. Come on now, we're not done yet. And we're gonna pick him up for a pump handle power slam. Uh oh. He blocks the kick. They wanna. I wanna get a, a good reversal on him. There we go because I don't want him to run off when we try to send this full straight to hell. Number three, and that's gotta be it, right? Yes, it does. Your new mega champion, ladies and gentlemen, is Voorhees. The legends were true. The Spectre Jr. fights with the strength of the gods and the cunning of a predator. It was a fight with consequences. And it was clear that we were fighting for our lives. It was sheer that allowed me to mount a final furious attack, which defeated the Spectre Jr. All the pain and My most glorious achievement was well worth it. To finally hold the gleaming Mega Championship belt in my hands was an evil dream come true. Tremble when you hear my name. I am the rudest of the rulers. Well, th there you go. Voorhees just probably murdered El Spectro Jr. with that chair. Oh my gosh. And that's gonna be it, apparently. Let's take a look and see if we've uh, unlocked everybody. No, there are four people left to unlock. And it looks like, a, oh no, I was going to say, looks like Spectro Jr. is one of them. But who are these four? I'm going to figure out how to unlock those four guys. And um, unless those are considered custom, I don't know, we'll see. But let's see, we got La Parca, El Aguido, Granda, Vampiro Candanese. Charlie Manson, Octagon. Now these guys, I'm assuming, are, I think all, are all the uh, Technicos. Superfly, El Messias, Cybernetico, Abismo Negro, Apache, Alan Stone. 
And then over on the Rudo side, Dr. Wagner Jr., El Brazo, Killer Clown, Zombie Clown, Psycho Clown, Psychosis, Conan, Kinzo Suzuki, Dark Oz, Dark Cuervo, Dark Scoria, Chessman, El Zorro, Electroshock. Well, that's not true. Oh, yes, it is. And a Spectro Jr. And I just realized that right above Dark Cuervo and Oz says Rudos. And right above El Legito and La Parca says Technicos. So I'm going to figure out how what we got to do to unlock these last four people. Um, we'll see. We'll see what that is. We can go into the extras here and look at some biographies. And I want to see a Spectro Jr. Look at this dude. It It's so old, it's black and white. Man. Who else uh, do we want to take a look at? Let's take a look at Conan. Look at this old school Conan. La Parca, of course, the old bag of bones. There's Psycho Clown, that mask. Jeez. Vampiro. Check him out, man. Look how young he is. That's awesome. Zombie Clown. Yuck. And Abismo Negro. We've already looked at him. Alan Stone. Woo-wee. We got El Apache. 35 years experience. And he is uh, the legend of AAA. Charlie Manson looks a little bit more like Marilyn Manson. Chessman. That's a scary looking dude. Kind of looks like Sting. Cybernetico. Look at that eye over there. It's got an X in it. How nuts. Dark Cuervo. Kind of a little messed up Sting. Mm, I don't like that. Dark Scoria with that... Uh, oh, what's the guy from Spawn? The little fat clown. I don't even... I can't remember his name right off the top of my head. Dr. Wagner Jr., um, he actually just lost his mask. He sure did lose his mask recently. El Brazo. El Guido shaking that ass. El Messias with those crazy eyes. Look at him. He looks like Interview with a Vampire. Ugh. Spectro Jr. There's Granda, who apparently is um, a good guy. The good, uh, the good gargoyle or something like that. Kenzo Suzuki. I don't know how they wrestle with these rubber masks on. They don't. It would seem like they wouldn't stay on. And that is everyone. Nice. Now, okay, I'm going to figure out what we got to do. Unless it's an online thing, we can't play online. You see the screen, screen blinking? I don't know what to do here. Um, King of Kings is a tournament. Let me know if you guys want to see something like that. Um, that, would be, that could be fun. We can uh, put the tournament number... Uh, let's see... Yeah. All right. And so you just kind of pick uh, random. Oh, apparently I'm starting. So I would be Killer Clown over there on the far right. You know, we go up the ladder, King of Kings. So if you guys want to see something like that before 2K18 comes out, we can do that as well. But that is going to be it for this video, guys. It was a wild ride, and only four episodes in the Rudos campaign as opposed to like 10 in the Technicos campaign. It is what it is. We got the victory. Now, I did notice at the end of the Technicos campaign, we gave the title back to La Parca, but at the end of the Rudos campaign, Voorhees was the champion. That's awesome. So, that's going to be it. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not. And guys, come back. I'll see you soon. Wow.